What's going on Royal Reliance and welcome back to a brand new Star Wars Battlefront 2 gameplay video and today we have brand new gameplay of Chewbacca in Battlefront 2 as well as some new Boba Fett gameplay from the inside of Kamino and the Death Star which is really cool but before we break this down make sure to let me know down in the comment section below what you are most excited for in Battlefront 2 and make sure if you are new to the channel to subscribe to be kept up to date with all Battlefront 2 content and see exclusive gameplay videos in the future. So we're going to start off with Chewbacca's three new abilities which are Furious Bowcaster, Shock Grenade and Charge Slam. We get to see all of these in action in this new Chewbacca gameplay and it all looks really cool. It looks a lot better than in the first Battlefront game which I'm glad to see. Shock Grenade looks pretty self-explanatory. You throw it at a group of enemies and it looks like it actually shocks them in place to the point where they can't move or fire at you so you can take them out pretty easy with Chewbacca. Next is Furious Bowcaster which looks like it sort of allows Chewbacca to rapid fire his crossbow rather than firing one bolt at a time. It only lasts for what looks like a couple of seconds in this because he absolutely destroys one of the stormtroopers in front of him and then goes back to firing it normally. Whether that will be extended in the full game we don't know but it looks like a very quick rapid firing Bowcaster ability. His third ability is Charged Slam, where he just literally sprints towards some enemies, jumps up in the air, I'm guessing that will be at the second press of that ability button, and then you will slam down on the floor, which works, or looks like it works, in a similar way to how his slam ability did in Star Wars Battlefront 1. We also get a really cool new look at Kashyyyk in gameplay this time, from Chewbacca's gameplay which we get to see at the start. You can get to see him taking out droids on Kashyyyk alongside clone troopers and Kashyyyk looks really amazing. It looks incredibly detailed and very realistic to the Star Wars movies. And I can't wait to actually get to see full gameplay of this planet. I think it's probably going to be one of my favourite locations in Battlefront 2 and I just really want to play it. Then at the end of the Chewbacca gameplay we get to see Chewbacca facing off against Darth Vader on the Death Star. Darth Vader's heading towards him blocking Chewbacca's bowcaster shots and we don't know what happens and the Death Star by the way is looking really cool it looks like it's got a lot more verticality to it in Battlefront 2 compared to the first Battlefront game where it was very much close quarters go from room to room and in Battlefront 2 it looks like you're going to go from small rooms to large rooms and then even these sort of vertical platforms which is really cool and I like the damage around Darth Vader at the back there as well. Like I said as well, we got some new Boba Fett gameplay, but we already know what Boba Fett's abilities are. We've seen plenty of gameplay of him previously thanks to EA Play and the beta, but the one cool thing to point out is that we get to see Boba Fett inside of Kamino, and Kamino is looking absolutely fantastic on the inside, and those Phase 1 clone troopers look so good as well, I can't wait to get to play as them. The only other cool interesting shot from the Boba Fett gameplay, in my opinion, is the end scene where we get to see him going head to head with Luke Skywalker on Mos Eisley and Mos Eisley is looking like a very interesting map. We've seen it at night, sort of at dusk and then during the day so it looks like there's going to be varying map times in Battlefront 2 which is really cool to see and I really like how there's dust floating around. It looks like a very alive map and exactly how you would expect Mos Eisley to be in a Star Wars game. Let me know down in the comments section below if I have missed anything big from these two gameplay clips and make sure to smash a like on this video if you have enjoyed it. If you are new to the channel make sure to subscribe to join the Aurora Alliance, be kept up to date with Battlefront 2 content and see exclusive gameplay videos in the future. But other than that may the force be with you.